hello guys welcome to how to fix stack in this video guys we are going to fix the issue laptop or the PC wouldn't shut down when you click on this option shut down it's not working so how to fix this issue so first of all open the control panel and we will disable the hybrid shutdown options open control panel and go to view by select have large icon if category is selected select large icons here once you select large icons go to the power plants this option click on that once you click on that on the right left hand side click on choose what the power button does first option you need to tick and after that click on this option change setting that are currently unavailable and untick this option turn on fast startup recommended save it ok and try now try if you are able to shut down your laptop or not if still not we can create the shortcut I have already created a shortcut you can see here the shutdown shortcut so how to make a shortcut to shut down it you just need to double click on this button so how to make it let me delete this just you need to right click click on new and then click on shortcut and you need to type here shutdown command shutdown space slash s s means shutdown space slash t t means time and space zero zero means the second within a zero second it will shut down you can also type there 10 seconds if you want but leave it as zero it will instantly shut down ok I will give this command into my description box let me ok this is the command click on next and leave it as shutdown.exe finish once you finish the shortcut key is created here if this is the file of shortcut it to shut down it right click click on properties and we can change its logo so that it will visible within the all the icons ok click on advance this option change icons ok and you can see this button apply ok you can see the shutdown has been created same you just need to double click on this shutdown icon and your system is going to permanently shut down so this will fix your issue if you don't want to do the things like this don't want to use the button manually you can do it so we can go to the third method if the windows update is corrupted you can get this issue as well go to troubleshooter windows troubleshooter troubleshoot setting open it up additional troubleshooter in the windows 11 you will get this option other troubleshooter click on windows update and run the troubleshooter once this uh, windows update is done and it will find the issue after that try to update your windows if sometime windows is not updated you might get this issue as well so it will detect the issue and resolve your issue but make sure you update the windows after this ok windows troubleshooter is completed in the fourth method we will go to the device manager and in the device manager go to this option which says system devices expand that and look for this option Intel management engine interface just right click and simply uninstall it click on uninstall do not check the box ok once the uninstall is done just restart your system and you are good to go your issue will be fixed so hope your issue is fixed now if your issue is fixed then hit like subscribe and share thank you thanks for watching how to fix tech